YouTubers, hello. It's Melissa, the MLP Manager Bespoke Hairstyles. I hope you're well. This is Style Guide. I don't know how much, but um, this is a Style Guide posting. Um, previous posting, this is a part two. Previous posting is was about spritz mix and oil mixes. This posting is for those who want a quick style, who feel they have the right hair for this style. Apologies if this is not for you. Hopefully you'll find one of my other videos that um, you would find useful. But this is for any hair type. White, black, Asian, oriental, extension wearers, permed hair. If you feel you have the right hair to achieve this style, then this is for you. It is supposed to be under 10 minutes. A quick styling under 10 minutes. So I shall show you. Um, I like showing it to you up so you know what it's like and also you see how quickly it is to pull down um and you can work with it live that's the idea right i'm pulling it down now so unraveling the back see how quickly that is to unravel unravel the back unraveling the front i think all you need are some pins um get some pins just in case now you might not necessarily need them um, and then I'm just unraveling the front really quickly for you and as you can see I divided the hair in two with this hairstyle I will be turning around a lot you will not be really seeing my face because it's all work I'm working from like the back and I really want you to see what I'm doing okay so there we are I shall show you my hair down right there we are my hair's down now I hope you can see what I'm doing. Okay. Tr divide the hair. Start from here. And divide your hair in two. Divide your hair in two. I'm going to bend down so you can see. Right. Divide your hair in two. Can you see? Right. This is the back bit. This is the front bit. You might need bands to keep the back bit clear away from when you want to do the front bit. Okay. Um, and I'm going to just try and like wing it basically. Hope, hope my hair doesn't fall into, um, into this area. Right. I'm going to start here first. The fringe. Can you see how far back I've gone with the fringe? I've gone way back to like the center of your hair. To the center. Okay. And there we go. Now, we are, go we are going to do a loose inverted. It needs to be loose so that you can manipulate your hair when you want to kind of change the direction of the fringe. I am currently putting a couple across each other. I'm taking from the right a couple and I'm pulling it to the left and I'm just resting it on top. And I'm doing the same, taking the left and pulling it towards the right um, and then when we get towards the end this is the end be aware of whether you're pulling um, on your hair and then I'm literally just taking from the bottom bottom of it and I'm bringing it over um, still um, trying to give you the it's the herringbone effect I want you to kind of achieve I'm pulling it from underneath the fringe and over right underneath can you see and over okay so we're coming to the end of it and I always say please think about your follicles are you pulling because this is the front bit um, not that it matters you shouldn't be pulling anywhere and also if there are any bits sticking out um, don't worry about it don't try and start again um, just Push it down, tuck it in, um, pin it, or um, but just don't start again. It's just um, hair sticking out, and you can always get it to look neat by just um, pushing it down. And that's what I'm going to do um, at a later point. Now, I will review this hairstyle, but um, as I say, this is just a guide for you, um, to you for you to achieve this. So if you see any bits sticking out, that's all right. Right. Okay, so there, I've done the inverted. Now we do the back. Again, exactly the same rules as I applied to here. Take a couple from the side, 
Now, if you have short hair, flat twist it along, and then when you feel you can get the two ends to meet, then do this. Don't pull to try and get one across the other if you've not got the length yet. Be patient. Okay, and improvise. Right, can you see where my, uh, my first um, inverted started? I'm going over it. I'm going over it. Really, I'm taking from the sides, can you see? And I'm going over. I'm taking from the front side and I'm going over. Can you see my fingers just resting on top of them? There, I'm going over. I'll turn around again so you can see what I'm doing. So I'm literally just going down slowly, taking the sides and kind of using the sides to um, just to frame. Um, and when you, when you do it this way, um, the effect is it's a bit more bulkier. You get a bit more height with, with it. That, that's why I like doing it this way. Now, if you feel, because this could be dangerous, you are pulling on your follicles. Because when I do this hairstyle, I, I do it so you can enjoy it for a few days. So please be aware. If, if you are, just pull a little um, on it to release um, the tight pulls. Because you want to enjoy this hairstyle. Can you see me go to the um, left and right, left and right? Right, okay. So, bear with me because I am feeling my way through this. So, um, you know, when I'm normally doing it in, uh, in my bathroom, it's a, it's, a, it's a bit easier. Right, okay. So now I'm changing it a bit because it's, it's, it's halfway in and I want to start... Um, doing an inverted way I'm holding rather than resting my hand um, in the middle of it I want to kind of hold it in so that it's a little it changes its form a little bit and it feels a little bit secure because we're coming to the back where there's quite a lot of movement and I might um, if I don't do it a little bit tighter secure up um, it might become undone so that's why I'm changing instead of resting my hand I'm holding it in position and I'm continuing to braid inwards. Right. Now, when we come to the end, just because I prefer, um, I prefer my hair to be left out um, because I'm working and I need to move my neck. And if I braid right to the end, um, I won't be able to, perfect example of just don't worry about it if it's, um, if something's, loose just tuck in and that's why i like doing it live so you can see there are challenges just work with the challenges basically it's not a big deal it's only hair it's just that's why i'm doing this so you just do it quickly and then that's it you go on and enjoy the rest of your day can you see me braiding it to the end braid it to the end and i've tucked it in and that's it can you see now the front uh, you could do it like this you could tuck, tuck it in, the, on, in under like this. I just want it over and tucked in. And so that's what I'm doing. Tucked in over and that's it to give you height. I want the height. Okay. You could choose to use your pins now and just secure it a bit more. Which is what I've just done. Pin it down. And that's it. You could... Well, I'm going to use a second pin just to bring it, secure it in the forward position. And that's it. Do you like? If there are loose bits, don't worry about it. I will talk it in. But this is just another style to help you. Hope you've enjoyed this posting. I shall take pictures at the end um, and stay connected. Please keep subscribing. I totally appreciate I totally appreciate all your comments. I am loving the interaction. Um, stay connected and take care of you. Thanks again for watching this posting. Thank you for supporting us. Take care. Bye. Ah, well, Mono Safel SK, original, Africa Ringa, Ada, Lawyer Entertainment present, yeah, Street Laughter. Tous les mondes est présenté vos chansons, s'il vous plaît, voici votre Esque Blaze original à Futuring Ada. Afrique, balancez, balancez, Afrique, bougez, bougez, Afrique, balancez, balancez, Afrique, bougez, bougez.
Balancer, balancer.